All sharks are still in, but Damon and Mark are concerned that Adele and Garrett might not need an investment for their Diamonds from Ashes company, Eternova. Do you understand where I'm seeing this as a problem? What he's asking you is, are you happy with the commercial that we're making for you right now? No, I mean, seriously, guys, our, our investors are wonderful. They're tech investors. They aren't the people who can help. This is a household, you know, branded experience, and we need partners that can help us get in front of consumers. Yeah, that but can you already have so to... much at your disposal. I just don't see it. I'm out. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. Let me, let me jump in for a minute. There's just something for me about this that just doesn't feel good to me. It doesn't feel right. Um, so I'm sorry, I'm out. Thank you, Lori, I appreciate it. Guys, look, I love the idea. You're a celebration company. Whether it's death, whether it's human, whether it's pet, whether it's birth, I would have loved to take a hair from my kids when they were born and put it in, you know, a diamond and give it to my wife as a, as a gift, even if it took 10 months. I actually love what you're doing. What I can't get my arms around is how, how serious you are about one of us as an investor. We're here to negotiate, Mark. We okay. would love to have you well, on our team. Then I'll make you an offer, mm -hmm. um, $600,000 for 15%. Would you be willing to come up to a $10 million valuation? Can't go lower than 10, just with the exactly. nature of it. Exactly. Yeah. You're proving my point about why you're here. You know? No, I mean, we would love to have you guys. I understand what Mark is saying, and he may be right, but it's a great business. But I hate the fact that you have the other investors, and yet you're here. So all I can speak to that with is my offer. Because if you value us, You've got to pay a premium for that. So I'll give you the 600000 for 10%. It's half the valuation you're asking for, but I think we bring twice the value. I also have an offer. I'll do it for 12%. 600 for 12. Fifteen, 12, 10. 10. Robert and Mark, would you guys be willing to go in at 500? For five percent each. You're, you're walking your line at you know it, your valuation from your previous investors is driving your negotiation. Mark's a great guy. I have no problem with having him as part of the deal if, if he wants to be part of the deal. But I have to have a better valuation. To Mark's initial point, the only place your pitch fell apart is when you told us about the investors. Kind of just you went right off the cliff. So if you want a shark, pay a premium. $500,000 for 5% each, but with 1% advisory shares for each of you guys? Uh, it doesn't work for me. I think you just made the point. I don't think you were here to get a deal. I'm out. Mark? You gotta do better, because I know I can help you do better. I'm not your other investors. Is there something in between? I'll listen, but you have to decide. Give him another offer. It's your deal to lose. So was it the 1%? OK, I'm going to buy my own machines. I'm out. OK. Um, would you meet us at an $8 million valuation uh, with the 1% advisory? So 600K for 7.5%. If you on, give me, Mark. <laughs> yeah, if you give me the 600K for 9%, I'll do it. And that might mean each of you giving up one point. 1% 1 from each one of you, the 1% advisory shares, the 6% for the 600,000, that gets you there. Let's do it. Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you guys were smart. <laughs> Congratulations, man. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. It was impressive.